Hey guys, welcome to IAFL channel. Today we are going to see the ways to install Jira in your local machine. If you are working in Agile project, I am sure you must have heard of Jira. Jira is a issue management tool created by Atlassian. According to a survey, Jira is the number one issue tracking tool in the world. It is used by top companies like Google, Apache and even NASA. So let's try to install Jira and be part of the family. First, we need to download the software. You can find the download link in the description of the video below. I'm going to download it. Since uh, Jira is a proprietary product, we are going to download the trial version of it. Select your appropriate uh, version that you require. I'm going to select Windows 64 bit and then clicking download. So it's getting downloaded here. Once it is done, we will see how to install it. Now the file is uh, downloaded. I'm going to start the installation. Now the file is downloaded. I'm going to run the installation as administrator. It is recommended to, uh, to run the install as a, as a system admin so that all the features are, are installed correctly. Now the installation has started. It will take some time. Let's wait for it. Uh, this is the installation wizard. Click next. Select custom install so that we can customize the installation path and port. Click next. This is fine. Click next. This is fine. Okay, and now select set custom value for the HTTP port. This port might be used by some other uh, softwares. So we can change it as we need. I'm going to change it as 8089 and this is 8009. Click next. You can select install Jira as a service. It can be started as a service by Windows. Click next and then install. This is going to take some time. So again, let's wait. We are about to end the installation. It's done now. You can see how to start it via command prompt. You can uncheck this, click next and then click finish. Once it is done, we can go to the path where we have installed Jira. In my case, this is the location. I'm going to the bin folder. You can see a lot of batch files. If you are on uh, Windows, you can use this batch file to start and stop the Jira server. If you are on uh, Linux or Mac, you can use the shell script files here to start or stop the Jira server. Next, I'm going to start a command prompt as an admin so that we can run the Jira server as an admin. I'm going to click run as admin. We have the command prompt open now. I'm going to move to the bin folder. Now I'm in the bin folder. Now we can start the Jira server. We can find the start jira.bat file here. Now we are going to start the Jira server with the batch file start jira.bat and then we are going to give the option slash fg to start the jira server in foreground mode i am going to give it so it will take some time to start it might take even uh, 5 to 10 minutes so please be patient now we are done with the installation process of jira in the next session we will see how to configure jira in the ui thanks for watching this video please watch the second session of this video Thank you.